The three people vying to be Norfolk's next mayor are zeroing in on their priorities as Election Day draws near. The candidates all spoke at an open forum this afternoon in downtown Norfolk. Ten on your size, Joe Fisher was there. And Joe, they're saying much of the same, right? Yeah, public safety and education are the top two priorities for each of the candidates. They all admit their minds are really on the same track here, which is why each of their backgrounds could be a deciding factor in who wins the race. State Senator Kenny Alexander, Norfolk Sheriff Bob McCabe, and Norfolk Councilman Andy Protegiero. All three men currently sit in powerful positions, but only one will be Norfolk's next mayor. Dedication, commitment, opportunities allowed me to be standing here today. I'm one of those that's known to follow through on things. I've been at the table. I don't need on the job training. The three candidates promise to focus on reducing crime, expanding the city's tax base and improving education. At a time when Norfolk is working to retain and attract millennials, Protegiro says we can't forget about the city's 40 plus schools, many underperforming. I do believe that the future is in after school programs. I do believe the future is in pre-K and making it as universal as possible so children are ready for school. Norfolk police say there's been 30 or more homicides each year over the last three years in the city. McCabe says his 22 years as sheriff is the experience the city needs to fix the problem. We have to make sure that our police department is has got everything they need to combat the crime because I say drug dealers aren't shooting drug dealers anymore. They're shooting grandmothers holding their kids on porches. Kenny Alexander says he's ready to leave Richmond for Norfolk, where he feels he can make a bigger impact. He wants to bring in new development, but he says that will only happen after addressing quality of life issues. Every prospect, when we market Norfolk, sell Norfolk, they pull the crime stats, they pull the graduation rate. They pull all of the same statistics that you pull and I pull. And parking downtown is one issue the candidates disagree on. Sheriff McCabe is ad advocating for more free parking downtown. He says it would fuel more tax revenue from an increase of people eating and shopping downtown. Protegiro and Alexander say they like the idea, but they say it's in the city's best interest to collect those parking fees, millions of dollars a year, in order to pay off the city debt for how much those parking garages cost to build. Election Day is May 3rd. Live in the newsroom tonight, I'm Joe Fisher. 10 on your side.